So one of the more simple questions, so how does it get jobs? How does it send the jobs? How does this all work? Right, and I think that how does it work is a really important concept. Um, so one of the things is your ATS is often the what houses your jobs. And if it's not, if you happen to be working without an ATS, absolutely, um, jobs can find their way into a programmatic platform through other means, such as uh, CSV files, flat files, all sorts of options. But for the majority, most people have their jobs in an ATS. Uh, to get the jobs out of the ATS depends a lot about that ATS and what, um, how they're built and how they're willing to work with third-party providers. So um, a lot of these guys will provide data via something called an XML feed, which is just a big file that has all the, the coded uh, jobs data within it. Some of them like to provide data via an API, which is a way for you to reach in and grab a bunch of data that you need. And if all else fails, there's a concept called the scraper which I'm sure most of you are familiar with, which is where basically a computer program just checks your site a bunch of times a day and rips all the data out and recreates it somewhere else. Once the, the jobs are into the programmatic system, it then allows um, the system to then take those jobs, slice them, dice them, julienne fries, whatever you gotta do, but get them over to the different job sites that they belong to via, again, the method in which that job site wants the data. So some of them want data via XML and some of them want via API. And the programmatic system should be willing and able to adapt to what the job sites need in order to get your jobs to where they need to go.